And we're here at the Newcastle Farmers Market, and that we're going to do this show a little bit different. We're starting <laughs> off. Greg, it's lunchtime. Yeah, yeah, you're late today, Sam. Yeah, yeah. So Greg <laughs> said, "I got to eat." So we're going to. And what a great place this is where we're sitting right here. But let me remind folks where we're at, in case you're not familiar with Newcastle Farmers Market in Wilmington, Delaware, on Route 13, right there at 273. If you're coming from the different area, right diagonally across from Newcastle County Airport. Newcastle Farmers Market over 40 years, open what? Over 60 years. 60 years. Unbelievable, Tim. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And, and easy to get to. I mean, it's really a, uh, uh, a, from the 95 and the, and the 295, 495, right on 13. Uh, people come from all over, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Maryland. Uh, you know, that's a great place to come and uh, obviously the tax-free shopping. But people come here to get their produce every week, Tim. As we know, it's a huge attraction. and. Their meats and cheeses from the, our Dutch section, and uh, and then the, the many places to eat. So this is uh, these guys uh, yeah. just recently took over an old restaurant here, and they renovated it, and they got these great booths here, and they make a great cheese steak, which is what I'm waiting yeah, for. Yeah, and we're going to talk a little bit more in depth about this. But let me remind you, we're open Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Friday and Saturday, nine to nine. Sunday, ten to six. What's up? The, the, the Dutch se section, Pennsylvania Dutch section, is not open on Sunday. So if you want to come in for the stofus. Got to do it Friday or Saturday. They're two days a week, yeah, from uh, 9 to 9, Friday and Saturday. So we're going to, uh, you know, uh, talk about, you know, hopefully some of the places that we like to eat at. And this is uh, well, one of them. These guys really uh, do a good breakfast, lunch. Yeah, because uh, that's what caught my eye. Uh, you know, they've redone it. They put new floor in. They've done, they've done quite a bit. And uh, I think she's coming in right. with great food right this. now. This is a uh, Philly, Thank you very much. Philly Look at cheese that. steak made with love, right? Yes. Get some hot, got some hot sauce. I like hot, hot sauce, sauce on my yeah. cheese steak. Well, hey, Everyone likes it a little own. different. Mushrooms, onions. I like it nice and plain, simple. Well, but that I looks like great. It the way they've got it. I mean, look great. at Great. I'll take them. Thank you. All right. It's nicely chopped. Yeah. Yeah. So um, great place for a cheese steak. I think they uh, have probably uh, one of the better cheese steaks in the market. Hopefully some of my other vendors aren't watching. But there's a ton of places to eat here, Tim, we know. We have Alex's Seafood for your seafood. We got Los Doritos and the other uh, Taqueria Los Doritos, two little Mexican stands. Of course, the pizza is amazing. Uh, and then we have Young's Restaurant, and we have, you know, Byler's Barbecue, Stoltzfus Sausage. Uh, we have the Indian Restaurant. So there's, a, there's a, I think, 15 places to come eat here. And, you know, you see people walking around with a pretzel, styles. with a donut, with, uh, yeah. you know, some chicken, maybe a turkey leg from uh, Alex's Barbecue. Um, you know, you can come here probably for months straight every weekend and get something different to eat. So it's a yeah, huge track. Yeah, and, and quite a few, like you said, quite a few different places here to choose from. And each one has its own unique style and blend. Yeah, I like this. The, the Philly cheesesteak is uh, going to be a hot one here. Uh, oh, yeah. And Hot this has been, been around, it's been redone. Yeah, a couple times. Yeah, a couple but times. It's, it's, it's been around for a while. And Greg's going to chow down mm. on his cheesesteak. Let me remind you once again, we're at the Newcastle Farmer's That's Market. That's a good cheesesteak. Located on Route 13. Do what now? That's Is a good, good? cheesesteak, <laughs> <laughs> I can see Keep the talking. smile change on your face. Keep talking. What I remind you to, also, a lot of people come out here each week, as Greg said, to check out your fruits and vegetables and all that produce stands on both ends of the market can't go wrong that's a good starting place the stofus meat section but the rest i got this for you tim oh wow so that's now what what is this what do this? we got here that's what, the what uh, is this? the house special salad with spinach um chicken um eggs and that looks apple awesome. onions. And yeah and the, and the dressing is what kind of dressing is house special dressing how special dress. Tim, it smells. I got great. you the health food. It it smells delicious. I mean, just uh, my mouth's watering. Yeah. So we're gonna really, eat. Looks really good. That's. We're gonna eat. And we're gonna tell you some more about the market. And as you're going through the Newcastle Farmers Market, it's much more great than just food. Even though you want to stop at every <laughs> food place down there. This is true. There. This is true. But one of the nicest things shops you have here in the market is Cohen Furniture. I mean, you guys been here now. This is Will. How are you, my friend? How you doing? How you doing? I'm all right. Yeah, now you, it's coming into the, Greg and you guys were talking, tax time. I mean, some great deals going on for you guys. Oh yeah, a lot of great deals. Uh, 20, 30, 40% off right now for tax time. Um, we have layaways as well, financing. We got no credit, um, no credit, bad credit. Um, 
doesn't matter, we got it, we'll deliver it, no money down. We have it all here. We have the 12-month finance, we got two years, whatever you need, we have it. Yeah, when, when you're talking about that, because, you know, the finance is here, but what's nice about it is you guys are a lot bigger than what here at the market. You got a lot more. You got catalogs to look at, you know, so you guys can get, if you're out there and you're shopping for furniture, some and, and great deals. I don't know how you do it with pricing. Oh, yeah. All you got to do is bring us a picture from any place, and uh, we'll beat it. We'll beat the price for sure. You know, we have lower overhead over here, so we, we'll make it work. We got a monitor back there thousands and thousands of pieces in anything any furniture you could think of we you can have just come in and, and swipe through a digital catalog and if it's out there and you want it yep. they're going to be able to get it for you it's obviously not just you know what's in the store here tim this is display stuff give you an idea yeah what i what i like about it too is the layaways that they have you know uh, some great credit options i mean it doesn't matter what your credit situation you need furniture in your house you guys will get the furniture it doesn't matter no credit as long as you have a job you got it, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, you, got you know i see people pulling mattresses out a lot too will right are you guys you're big on selling oh yeah we're very big on mattresses um we have all of them we have the hybrids the gel um they start at 200 and they can go up all the way to a thousand depending on what you want but we have it a lot of we have every type every brand we have it all well, most places started at thousand, go up from there. So that you know, so that's still great deals on well, the price points for all customers. You can, you can get a good mattress for that we would sell normally for fifteen hundred, for six hundred dollars, and a mattress that normally would sell for eight hundred, for three hundred because we buy a lot of stock. You know, we focus on the best ones and we buy a lot of stock so we can give good deals for our customers. And it's the it's the right time, tax time. So this is the right time to come and shop. Yeah, and then come right on down here, and like you said, layaway delivery, it's all here for you. Cohen, another great shop here in the Newcastle Farmer's Market, and, and been here for a while, too. I mean, you guys, uh, you know, I, I look, since I've been coming out here. That's the biggest store in the markets, and uh, yeah, Will's been down here for just as long, about as long as I have, almost 10 yeah, years yeah. now. It was a previous shop, uh, but I, furniture I, shop's a little different I'm going to stand up and walk in front of you guys, because I want to get one more thing out there, because there's an audience that we don't normally reach out oh, our to Hispanic in our population. Hispanic community oh, out there. So I just want to come over here. You know it better than I do. Introduce yourself and tell the Hispanic community about Cohen Furniture. Sí, nosotros estamos aquí en Cohen's Furniture en la entrada de la Newcastle Farmers Market, siempre trayendo lo mejor de muebles para ustedes. Si necesitan, vengan a vernos. Aquí tenemos layaway, financiamiento, también pueden traer su troca y llevarse, tenérselo esta noche. Ahora, si necesitan ayuda, vengan, pregunten por Ale y yo le ayudo con lo mejor que puedo. <laughs> And always doing something for you. you know? yeah. <laughs> yeah, always, always a pleasure. So I want to get back over into these guys and uh, just uh, tell them. We're just having couch talk, Tim. Talk about our kids, you know. Yeah, yeah. We don't have time to catch you up. You know, Will so. said something, Tim. I should mention. He, he said, you know, they're able to sell, you know, uh, items like mattresses for lower than what you can get them elsewhere because they buy in bulk. And it kind of reminds me of our produce stands. You get prices that you can't beat anywhere in your local grocery store because they buy so much of it and they go through so much so that's like a huge reason that this is a successful market the prices are cheaper and the quality is the same or better but the market the newcastle farmers market i tell everybody is a one-stop shopping for all your needs we good example mm -hmm. cohen furniture to produce to getting a shoe fix get your I shoe mean, fix get your shoes shine yeah anything. we have a seamstress that we've mentioned before on the show that she's becoming really popular i mean where do you find a seamstress easily these days where you can come in and say, hey, I need these hemmed, uh, my pants hemmed, or I need a button put on, or I have a tear. So, you know, she's great. Um, and even big great projects, addition. if you've got big projects, drop them off this week, and she'll have it ready for you next yeah. week. So it's a- uh, Watch batteries. Right oh. Cheapest place to get a watch battery changed at Fashion Link. He don't ever change his price. Jewelry repair. I've been sort of going to get more batteries changed for that man yeah. for I, I, as long as I remember it's the He's same price He's been doing it for time. over 30 years and he hasn't changed his price in 30 years. Yeah, it's un unreal. So it's all here for you at Newcastle. I'm going to get back over here and tell Will to tell him <coughs> Will, one good more luck time tax can about tax time. Yep, yep. Um, come on in and uh, let's make it work. Let's, let's make these deals. Um, come on in. Like I said, no credit, bad credit, no money down. We'll have it delivered as long as you have a job. We're talking about the unique places here at the market. One of the places is Chikumba. When you come in here, you talk about homemade ice cream. This is where. Look at that. This is different than your regular. Package ice about cream. six blocks from here. Oh, I'm telling you. They yeah. make it all every week. They make these uh, ice cream bars, and they have like some really awesome flavors. 
And uh, so, uh, you know, one it, of my favorites, pistachio. Oh, it, it's just unbelievable, their flavor and everything they have. Uh, you know, whatever you're looking for, they got it. Yeah, they have about, how many different flavors do you have? Like 15, 20? Uh, four. So. We have the ice cream bar. Yeah. We have the fruit bars. So no, yeah, fruit bars. It's so many. It oh, that's right. Strawberry and um, pistachio, rice, butterscotch. Um, cream, chocolate, um, coconut, lemonade, vanilla, cheese, ice cream, eggnog. So you can see we have many flavors. Oh yeah, the Oreo. That's another one of my favorites. Yeah, and and, and, and this is all homemade right here. I mean, it's a yeah. It's a. They're busy, Tim. I'm telling you, they're I, busy in the winter. Can you imagine yeah. what it's like in the summer? I don't. But uh, yeah. oh. he wants. Uh, Look at that. that. That's all. Butterscotch. Butterscotch. Oh, is it really? Yeah. I haven't had that before. But uh, Chumba, right here in Newcastle Farmers Bar, Greg's uh, enjoying an ice cream in the middle of uh, winter time here. Middle but of February. To stay busy. I mean, you know, I know they're. Oh yeah. Now they're busy the, year round. The warehouse right down the street, they constantly putting it out. Nice thing is when you're here at the market, you get it and you take it home with you. But the kids just love going around the market and eating the thing. Oh, this this is a very popular store here at the market. Um, we've been, we, we're really happy to have. It's a great family that runs it. They work really, really hard. And um, you can tell because their products like just fabulous. I mean, it's really, this is unique. It's a unique thing because you don't get this anywhere really. Something like this? No, you can't. It's, 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 you got to come out and try it because it's different than your normal everyday ice cream. That's for sure. It's really, really good. The flavor is what I like. When you say pistachio, that tastes like you're eating pistachios. I mean, that's well, what they I make it with the real. Their fruit bars have real fruit in them. But so. we, as we come down through the market, I just want to give the people an idea, Greg, that you can find any we try to tell you this each and every week if you haven't been to the newcastle farmers market you owe it to yourself to do so because there's so much we talk about the county dump this is like the first dollar store that ever existed i mean you know when you talk about the it's county here dump. forever and you know, right now over here special where, where are you going to go and find a specialty on socks Folks, if you need socks and you can buy them anywhere else, you're crazy because this guy's got more socks than any place I know of. They have uh, more socks than anybody. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> the diabetic socks are really popular too. We should mention that a lot of people come here for those. So it's something to uh, keep in mind. You know, I guess they're unique to how the uh, how the sock is made or something, but uh, it's, but it's popular here. We're, we're coming over here and this is uh, lunchtime here at uh, Stouffer Sausage and Sandwich. Line goes back against the, around the wall here. Uh, there's so many people. Yeah, you know, just every week it's a, the same thing. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Not on Sunday because they're not open on Sunday. So if you want one of these great sofa sandwiches, mm -hmm. you've got to come out here during the week because that whole section of the Pennsylvania Dutch. And I know there's no way Greg ever walks by this without sticking his head into the donut area. I can't here. have a donut and an ice cream cone at the same yeah, time. Yeah, I can't, I can't do it, huh? <laughs> Andre, you making some donuts back there, buddy? Uh, yeah, we're finishing it up. Yeah, he's, he's cleaning up everything back there. They've been making donuts. If you come around to this, I want to come around over Sounds here. six in the morning. Yeah, because they start early on, but you just can't beat check it. it out. I mean, it doesn't get any fresher. I mean, it's made right, right behind there. Come over and put it in this cabinet. Yeah, yeah sometimes you'll get them warm. But yeah, they're incredible. The cream shot into it right here where you're watching it. They do it all. I mean, they do it all right here. The and they yeah. have uh, a great, great bagels too, Tim. If you like to get some bagels home for the weekend. Pennsylvania Dutch section, one of the unique sections here at the Newcastle Farmers Market. We talked about food and everything. As you walk down through here, we got to talk about restaurants and things like that. You can sit down and grab a bite to eat. But you got to look at the food flavoring out here just everywhere you go. You can find something, you, can, you know. Here's the uh, pretzels. This is the du Dutch pretzel, which is a little different from the Philly pretzel. Guess what? We have that too. Of course, right? Right. You can get a Philly pretzel on the other side of the market, but his are a little different. But he also has these little pretzel sandwiches, and you can get like a pizza pretzel wrap or turkey. They have scrapple, sausage, bacon, 
and they're really good. Yeah, I, I mean, it's really just my, my, my wife loves pretzel sandwiches, and these are pretzel hot dogs come out here. They're, they're oh, yeah, very, the, the little Smokies here, the, the little hot dogs wrapped up, and then they got the bigger version right there. And they do it right oh, here. They, they make it. The girl over here rolling it out right now, she just got the dough out and cutting it up. And, She's making pretzels as, as we're going by. I mean, you can watch it all happen. We're here at the Pennsylvania Dutch section here at the Newcastle Farmer's Market. Just food everywhere you look. Here's then, a unique, unique area right here. Christian, how are you? Good, how are you, Greg? This is a unique coffee bar. Tell me, tell me about it, Chris. What all you guys got going on? Uh, all of our coffee that we get here comes um, from all over the world, actually, but it's roasted fresh weekly in Lancaster County, actually in Lancaster City. They get it in Monday. They roast it Monday and Tuesday. We pick it up on Thursday and then brew it here weekly. So that's what we're brewing uh, straight. It's what we use for espresso and all of our specialty drinks like lattes and whatnot. And then we also have uh, feature bags here for you guys to take home with you. Yeah, and that's what it's all about. Good way to come up here and taste the coffees, the different ones that, that, that's here. And then buy it and then do I'll it at home. I'll your dark roast, Kristen. Absolutely. And anytime anybody wants to try something, we'll gladly give them a taste. Anytime somebody Resamps. wants to try something, they gladly give them a hey, taste. Can I sample a large chocolate milkshake, please? Whoa. You're doing milkshakes, right? Only Greg gets uh, pretty <laughs> large samples. But anytime. <laughs> sample a milkshake. I didn't know that. Yeah, something a lot of people don't know, we'll give them a quick lesson. The light roast actually has more caffeine in it than dark roast. So if you ever need a real... Uh, Why is that? Dance, I don't understand that. Uh, Dark roast is actually, everyone, uh, or not everyone, but a lot of people really like the taste, but it's actually a lesser quality bean because they don't have to care as much about how the bean was because it's technically a broken bean, whereas okay. lighter roast, they have to take more time and inspect all the beans because if there are flaws, they'll show up in that lighter roast. As far as the caffeine, though, I'm just assuming you're burning some of it out when you do a dark roast. This is really well, good that's, coffee. That's interesting because you see these guys, you always see them. You, know, give me that yeah, you think the dark roast is the strong stuff, but you go for the light stuff, it'll wake you up more. A little both delicious, though. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Both delicious. I've been fooled for a long time now. Yeah, Thank you for the uh, coffee <laughs> lesson, Christian. I didn't know it either. These are yeah. re it's really good coffee. Uh, yeah, and, and I'm telling you, uh, you can take bags home with you, Greg. It's here for you. Pennsylvania Dutch section here in the market. Thanks, we'll Christian. talk yeah, about it. Some ice cream. It has, the food. Yeah, the ice cream you know, is... Where, where uh, go, I was just saying, we'll fatten you up with some ice cream as well. We've got a Lancaster County made uh, Yoder's ice cream here. Very rich and creamy. So, cuff, uh, you don't need caffeine. We'll... Fix your sweet tooth at least. How do you pronounce that? Gers Guernsey's tracks. Guernsey's it's, tracks. Um, it's moose tracks if you ever had it, but the type of cow that they use to produce their milk is a Guernsey cow. Oh. And they just like to brag about that because it's a very uh, high fat content milk, so it creates a very creamy ice cream. So it's just nothing wrong with that. Of, uh, bragging about their cows. Yeah, we nothing got wrong with that. Cows than you got. I guess so. <laughs> Our cows are way creamier. It's here. You guys, the farmers market Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Awesome. Friday and Saturday, nine to nine. Sunday, ten to six. The Pennsylvania Dutch section is closed on Sunday, so if you're coming out Sundays. here, be sure you uh, you know visit that on Friday or Saturday. On Friday and Saturday. But it all starts before you even enter the building, Greg. That's what you know. My favorite thing. Oh, the flea market. How do you do the Newcastle Farmers Market? You, know, you don't do the flea market because they're out there. As I came in today, yeah. I mean the weather's kind of cold. They're out still there year got round. Vendors out year round, but we're coming into the springtime. We're coming into the big season. Um, you know, we have over 200 spaces outside, and you're going to get everything you could possibly find from gently used merchandise, antiques, and collectibles. That's really how to sum it up. But uh, lawn equipment. Uh, you know, dishware, you know, electronics. Yeah, and when, you, and when you say that, I want people to understand, even though there are vendors that are outside, and, and they're, the majority of them are here every week. Yeah, so and you it, can buy a lawnmower, and you get something wrong with it, they're gonna fix it back up for you, so. Yeah, yeah I mean, they these stand guys are, behind it, they stand, they do, they truly don't do. Don't go buy a new shovel, a new rake, a new lawnmower, a new weed whacker. Don't 
don't buy it new until you come out at least and look around and see if you can find something that's going to be less than half of what you're going to pay new. Works just fine. Yeah, so and, and it's like, worth like you checking said, out. And, and they're, they're here, so tools, if it doesn't work, right, tools, they, they, they tools. take care of it for you. You got every, anything and everything you're looking for. I don't care what you're looking for. It's going to be out there on, on one of those tables. Yeah, I mean, if it's not pouring rain, they're going to be out there. But like you said, it's coming into the busy season, and we'll start filling up every weekend. And you can come out earlier than the inside market's open. Those guys are setting up after 6 a.m. You know, you get the bargain shoppers, the bargain hunters out there early in the morning looking for good deals, yeah, trying I, to find the right thing. I always tell people, if you're going to have a garage sale, the heck with that. Have, come out here and get oh, yeah. a space for a couple of days, and you'll be amazed. One day, two days. 3,000 sure. 3, plus people coming through the market each, each and every week. So, oh, there, Hey, Miss Anna. There's, there's one of our mainstays. i got to say hi to everybody, Miss Anna. Well, hello there. How are you today? I'm doing good. Now, you've been out the market how long now? Oh, well, 60, oh, 60 years. Let me see, a little 60 plus. Yeah, so she's been here since the market. Very she first was day. Standing, she Very was first day, still Swiss meat. And they built the market around right. her. All right, there you go. Because <laughs> that's well, what it was. I it's mean, been a while, but it was a good run. I'd do it all over again. Yeah. She or has. Oh, you, uh, you're still here, though, right? Yeah, I'm working. I'm on my lunch break. Yep. Still working after yeah, 60 and, years in the same market. And you look for pies and cakes. Yep. She yep. works at her in the pantry area. Yep, that's right. We were yeah. gonna we're gonna go have to go take a look at the pies. And yeah, the cakes. yeah. But so, so much. Man. And well, let's go down this way as, as, as we're talking about it, because we're coming around the corner here. We're in the section. Might as well Tim, stay whoa, with whoa, it. Whoa, whoa, Tim, Tim, Tim. Chocolate, just Tim, yeah. Chocolate covered strawberries. You know, you want to make somebody happy. Oh, always chocolate covered everything right there and then this is the poultry section of the meats here at the, the yeah look at that stuff man that's incredible pennsylvania dutch section they've got it broke down salad bar so meals prepared that you take home yeah you can come in and get your uh amish potato salad if you like that or your philadelphia style potato salad but they also have you know great little um you know, seafood salads fantastic macaroni and cheese but they have these great desserts pudding desserts I mean, you can just come in here. You know, people are kind of getting tired of cooking all week long, you know, and usually you go out on the weekends or you just come in here, you can grab, you know, some salads, you can get some chicken and some ribs or whatever at Byler's Barbecue. And the nice thing is, desserts. even if you don't feel like preparing the meats, they do that for you. I mean, they've got it where you can have, get something already stuffed and everything else. But I like this here, because let's add to it and say, Hey, I, I want some dessert to go along with dinner. Well, I want some donuts for in the morning. I, you know. He's got the fritters over here, the brownies. You can get uh, the um, these are these this pumpkin uh, roll. Oh, cream cheese in there. Too. Uh -huh. Sugar. But it's it, you know the thing the thing about it is now you got to remember you're in the Pennsylvania Dutch section. All this is made fresh. You know, this, how many most times of it, you most buy, of it's baked here. Um, how many times you buy a cake, take it home, you got to throw half of it out because it's set too long. Yeah, no, it's it's definitely fresh. It's half, brought in each half, week. Half for sure. cakes, and, and you know, uh, you buy, you don't have to buy the whole cake. You can buy by the slice, buy by a half cake, quarter cake, whatever you want. They've got it here for you. Yeah, it's good it, for entertaining. They have their awesome dips. Those are all handmade dips over here in that one case, and you can, uh, you know, there's got to be what. 20, 25 different dips, and uh, th that's great for entertaining. You know, if you want, chips, if you're yeah. if you're having some company over, you can come over. You can get some chopped cube cheeses, and just just makes life easier when you're entertaining, or if you're not, you're you know, you don't want to cook anymore, and you know, people are it's, there's regulars come in here every weekend, Tim. They know what they're doing. But it's it's all here for you, and and this is where you can always find Anna too. That she goes by us now. She's off her lunch break back at work. She's she's the hardest worker. Oh, I'm place, telling man. you, she's been here over 60 years. They can't get her to retire, so. But it, this is Stoltzfus Meats right here, uh, and you know, there's 80 feet of deliciousness. Any type uh, of meats, you know, steaks. Yeah, there's butchers on site here, so if you need something fixed up right, they'll do it for you. Um, they got a great, they got great bacon tin smoked right up in Lancaster, brought down here every week. And then they have the, they have awesome uh, pork tenderloins that, that are stuffed pork. Uh, right. Like, to tell you that, you know, we can go and show all the stuff that's out here at the market and all that. But the main thing is, if you guys notice, is we're walking through the market, the amount of people that are here gotcha. on a Friday 
Yeah, it's crazy. Mid midday. Yeah, we're know? blocking the hallway. Yeah, here. It, and it's just fresh squeezed juices, Tim. It's unbelievable. And they tell me, this is hey, come out to the market. That's where you're going to find your best deals. I mean, this place is just packed like this. Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Friday, Saturday, nine to nine, Sunday, ten to six. Coming on down, we're in line now. Yeah, we're not we're not getting any food anytime, so we'll be here for an hour now. They're pretty quick about it, so yeah. Um, more and more food. We talked about food as you come to the Newcastle Farmers Market, located on Route 13, diagonally across from the Newcastle County Airport. And let's just make a left and, and walk down through here a little bit further, Greg, because we're talking about just trying to show you the amount taste. of stores and choices that you have as far as food. Clothes, shoes, I mean, it's all here. You talk about the, uh, the Indian. There yeah, they have are. really good food. Um, the Boss Kitchen. All vegetarian and, uh, you know, sits right next to an antique shop. What do you know? Only only, only this place. And then here we are over here by J&L Shoes. Work boots are high quality work boots. Some American made products in there. And then here's the you seamstress. You mentioned the seamstress. There, there she is hard at work, getting more and more in as, you go, as we come down through the market. She's, she's always busy. Oh, I'm telling you, doesn't get any better. That's uh, country wear, western wear. Yeah, if you're going to the rodeo, you got to stop here first. It's unbelievable. The guy got everything. That's where you get your hats, right, Sam? Yeah, this was the only place I shopped for boots or hats, right here. I mean, in any style, any, you know. You got your high dollar hats, you got your, you know, rodeo hats. You got your western gear. If you want to be look cowboy when you're going out to you got all these line dancing going on and everything else, you want to look the well, real you're a part. Texas man, aren't you? You know all about Yeah, that, you come in here, you know. And there it is. I mean, how do you want to go? Rough and rugged or, you know. Well, you can tell just how some of these stores are set up that these guys are the owner operators Tim, We don't mention that enough. It's not like the uh, you know, the impersonal kind of sort of, you know, experience you have at a big box store. You get really hands-on owner owner to, to customer, uh, you know, interaction, and it makes a big difference. And, 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 it keeps you coming back. They want you to keep coming back. So it'll take You're talking it. about that. I keep looking at here. He's got to be the largest Western wear shop in, in the state of Delaware. Yeah, probably. I mean, I just can't believe the amount of merchandise I see just standing there. So uh, why don't we mention our website, Tim? We should let everyone know we're at NewcastleFarmersMarket.com. We always have events going on at Market Stage. I don't know if we talked about that, but we have, uh, you know, health screenings from Christiana Care coming. Uh, they're here. Uh, once a month, and they'll be here March 16th. So you can come in and get your cholesterol checked for free, you get your uh, blood pressure checked for free. They can give you advice, health tips, ideas where what, you need to go to get stuff coming? checked out. What else is coming? It's the 17th of March, we have our family fun day, we call it. Magic Bob comes out and does a magic show from 12 to 1, and then he does a uh, face, face painting, painting and balloon twisting from 1 to 3, and it's all free for the kids. We do that once a month usually around the holidays in each month, but you can check our calendar on our website, again, newcastlefarmersmarket.com. You'll see uh, our store listings of all the stores we have in here, because we can't mention it in one show. We have a really neat interactive map where you can scroll around and click on the store, and you can get a phone number if you need to call anyone or get an idea of what more we have than what we talked about today. But great food, great bargains, great produce. So, so I guess really, market. yeah. So we'll see you at the market. Peak. You can find it here, not at the mall. Get it?